Hey everyone, and welcome to another Pokemon card video. This is part three of my second Flashfire booster box. Today we're going to be opening the nine packs from Mega Charizard Y. Let's just get right to it. Trying to complete the set, guys. We've gotten four cards that I've needed so far. None of the Ultra Rares or EXs or whatever have been things I've needed, but I've got four of the Reverse Hollows I still need, so... I at least got something that I need, and we still have 18 packs to go, so there's still plenty of chances for me to get more stuff that I need, which is really exciting. I really want this to be the first set I complete. But here we have an Ultra Ball, Fletchender, Luxio, Bergmite, Pineco. I love Pineco, dude. I really feel like Pineco, he needs some more love. We need Pineco EX for some reason. We have Sfeel, Baneri, Caterpie. <gasps> yes! Another Reverse Holo Rare, dude, that I need. What the heck? We've gotten four Reverse Holo Rares that I needed. That is just absurd. I think we've... Wow. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm just gonna take it. We got Melodic. And the last card is a Skuntank. Four Reverse Holo Rares I needed. I am not gonna complain about this booster box. Even if I don't get any of the EXs that I need, I'm still happy, dude. Because EXs are easy enough to trade. Reverse Holo Rares are where it's at right now. Heck, give me the reverse hollow commons and uncommons I need too, I'd be fine with that. We have Magnetic Storm, Torkoal, Startling Megaphone, C-Dot, Skrelp, Shinx, oh my gosh, so cute. We have Scraggy, there's another Pineco, and a Stunky Reverse Hollow, and the last card is a Dusk Noir. I actually, this was the only hollow I did not pull in my first booster box, but somehow I have since acquired three of these. So this is actually my fourth Dusk Noir. I think people have sent me some. I got one in like an eBay lot or something, and now we got a fourth one. So my battery's about to die on my camera, guys. I'm gonna go swap the batteries. I'll be right back. We'll open the rest of these packs. All right, the battery has been replaced. Pro tip, guys, if you ever decide to make videos like this or anything that involves a camera, get a replacement battery. Because when I first started making these videos, I had one battery. And when that card ran out, I had to wait around for like two hours so I could start recording again. But let's get focused back in here. And let's go to the next one. My, my desk is just getting so cramped. I think, is this the first booster box I've opened here? No, I think I opened the wrong Skies booster box here. So I, I am in my new place in New York. I've been here for about two months now. And uh, I've been having a lot of fun. I really feel like the lighting in here is really nice. It looks, I just think it looks good. So I'm pretty happy about that. But here we have a Harden. Or, we have a Metapod. His name is not Harden. We have Miltank, Sacred Ash, Stunky, Litleo, Geodude, Phoebus, Centret. Uh, the Reverse Hollow is another Stunky. I feel like we have a lot of those. But the last card is a Pidgeot. I'm pretty sure I actually need this Reverse Hollow, so that's another rare. I, I guess I needed a lot more Reverse Hollow rares than I thought I did. Wow, that was one of those packs that opened really easy. Oop. I gotta stop doing that, dude. I, like, open it, and then I accidentally tweak the corner. It's probably not good for my cards. So I have to improve my pack opening technique. I know a lot of people open packs with scissors just to avoid any kind of ruffling around like that. Here we have a Rapidash, Furfro, Sligu, Buizel. Fletchling, Ponyta, Esper, Pidgey, yes, one of the other Reverse Hollows, is that another five Reverse Hollow Rares that I need? There is a Scrafty, holy crud. Well, I am excited about that. And the last card is a Drudagon Hollow. I actually have a couple of those, but still very cool. He's actually apparently quite good and competitive as well. I'm not sure if he's still used, but when the set came out, I'm pretty sure people used him. I don't follow the competitive too closely. I do know that, I think just yesterday, they announced that they're banning one of the one of the cards. It's been a long time since they've banned a card from competitive play, but there's a, called, a card called Lysander's Trump Card. I think it's from Phantom Forces. I can't remember exactly. Uh, but yeah, they banned it. So I think on June 15th, that ban is going to place. No one can use it, and that's just how it is. It makes sense. What the card did is it allowed you to shuffle, uh, both you and your opponent had to shuffle your discard pile back into your deck. And it kind of made it so people just discarded stuff without even thinking about it because they could just get it back easily. So it kind of made the games kind of boring. But here we have an Esper Reverse Hollow and a Furret. Nice. I already got that guy. I actually have two Reverse Hollow Furrets already. So we're doing, we're doing just fine on that. Oddly, I have two Furret Reverse Hollows, which is a rare. And I have only one Centret Reverse Hollow, which is a common. So sometimes the Reverse Hollow Rares are not that rare. I don't think it's... Super uncommon to get them. I've gotten, I've gotten like five or six of them in this video already, or in this uh, booster box. We have Croc -a Rock, we have Blacksmith, Love Disc, Caterpie, what up, Geo Dude? Yeah, Helioptile, Veneri, Sfeel, ooh, Reverse Holographic Dusclops. I don't 
think I need that, but that's still really cool. I think I need Dust Noir still. And the last card is a, another Scrafty, all right. Actually, no, I, I do have a Dust Noir Reverse Hollow. So the whole the whole Dust Dustclops, Dust Gold, Dust Noir, that whole line, I have that regular and reverse hollow, I think. There's still quite a few cards I need, though. So I've gotten five of the reverse hollows. I still need... No, I've gotten six, actually. I think I need 20 left, so still quite a few. We have Protection Cube, Avalug, Fletchender, Vinacle, Pineco, Buizel, Sentret, Sveal, a Fletchling Reverse Hollow, and the last card is a Weavile. Not bad. Two cards to go. Or, I always mix up terms. Two cards to go. Yes, definitely two cards. Not not two whole packs, just, just two cards. Well, the code card is one of them, so this is the last card, right? Uh-oh, guys, our last card's a Roserade. No, I'm kidding. We have Metapod, Torkoal, Veneery, Esper, Spritzy, uh, Litleo, Sneasel, Reverse Holographic is another Litleo, and the last card is... Oh! Oh, yes! One of the only cards I needed. Toxicroak EX Full Art. I don't have a regular Toxicroak yet, but I needed the Full Art as well. We got it! Oh, yeah! Oh, man, I was really hoping to get at least one of the Ultra Rares I needed. So there we have Toxicroak EX, 170 HP. Look at this. Look at that shiny. We got that gold border. Triple Poison. Smash up for cut. 102 out of 106. Oh man, we've gotten four EXs so far this video. Only one that I needed, but I'm so glad to see him. All right, let's get that guy sleeved up. We still got one pack to go. Watch as we pull another card that I need. Let's get like a, let's get a secret rare right now. Let's get a secret rare Mega Charizard X. It's like a $50 card. Let's just go ahead and pull one right now. Why not? Crazier things have happened, right? Well, that's actually pretty much the craziest card you can pull from this set. But here we have the last code card. The last pack, I don't know if this can top the pack we just opened though. Here we have a Fiery Torch, a Sligu, Furfru, Fletchling, Helioptile, Pidgey, Caterpie, Bergmite, Reverse Holographic is a Pineco, and the last card of the video is a Walrian. So that's definitely not going to top that Toxicroak EX. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about this. We still have nine packs to go, guys. I guess we'll come back tomorrow. Let's see if we can get another EX that I need. I'll see you guys then. Take care.